The DSPA-5 is a manual and portable fire knockdown tool based on aerosol technology. It's used by firefighters, but can also be deployed by trained personnel in companies, ships and hospitals. It's a flexible and most of all safe way to initially fight a fire, to prevent fire spreading and to gain time before the fire service arrives. The DSPA-5 can be stored accessibly in a special case or on a handle on a wall, armed and ready for use. An alarm call reaches the emergency center. The fire alarm has been triggered in a hospital and staff have seen smoke coming from a hallway door. A short circuit has ignited a curtain in a small restroom. The fire spreads quickly and adjoining rooms are in danger. This part of the hospital must be evacuated immediately. The first responder is trained to initialize firefighting, to look for people in danger, and if possible, to prevent the fire from spreading before reinforcements arrive. This can be a fireman, police officer, or trained staff member in a company. In this hospital, a security guard is trained to use the DSPA-5. The first responder and one of his colleagues bring the DSPA-5 to the hallway. On their way, they note the nearest emergency exit. To eliminate any uncertainty about the fire's intensity, the first responder uses the back of his hands to sense heat coming from the top of the door, and in the same way, from the handle. The heavy smoke escaping around the edges of the door is a clear sign that the fire inside is intense and needs to be contained quickly. One of the biggest advantages of the DSPA-5 is that it doesn't have to be deployed at the seat of the fire. Therefore, it can be deployed safely from outside the compartment, for example, through a door. The first responders keep a low profile and position themselves so that the door protects them from the heat when opened. By firmly pulling the pin from the starter mechanism, the DSPA-5 is activated. The door is then opened just enough to throw in the DSPA-5. The door is closed and the first responders help evacuate the hospital. It's important to keep the room closed. This way, the aerosol will be more effective. After eight seconds, the DSPA-5 is activated. Aerosol is released and soon the room is completely filled. In seconds, the flames are beaten down and the temperature drops drastically throughout the area. Since the fire is now unlikely to spread to other parts of the hospital, evacuation can be calm and organized. Firefighters have more time to arrive at the scene and to prepare their equipment. After the firefighters are briefed by the first responders, they finish the job, using significantly less water to extinguish the remaining fire. Unnecessary water damage can be avoided this way. After all, water damage can be 60 to 70 percent of the total costs of a fire. In other words, a job well done. <laughs>